The invasive pests that you've probably come across, those spotter and lantern flies, are now laying their eggs to get ready to hatch in the spring. Experts say the only way to control them is to kill them. So a group of local students is taking matters into their own hands, sharing their efforts with CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis. Spotted lantern fly sightings have become common, along with this reaction to them. They were everywhere, and um, they were a nuisance. Piscataway High School senior Veer Patel says he started reading about the impact of the invasive species, especially on agriculture. They're spreading rapidly throughout uh, New Jersey, and they're having a really big impact to the community. Compelled to do something about it, he turned to fellow leaders of the Science National Honor Society. I noticed it as I'm. Um, an opportunity for our students who are dedicated students of sciences, right, to actually really expand and actually have real world application skills. Together, the group created traps to target the pests using household items, no pesticides or chemicals. We're just using basic. Um, behaviors of lanternflies and taking that as our advantage. First, going to where they're commonly found. This is the tree of heaven. Then, since the pests like to crawl up the tree trunk to feed higher up, placing mesh in a way that directs the lanternflies into plastic bags or water jugs where they become trapped. It's also designed so that other bugs don't get caught in and they can also go around. Six traps in just three weeks are already yielding results. We're looking right at the work we've done and it's the most gratifying thing ever. ever. The teens give Giving thanks to an expert with Branchburg Public Schools who came to help, and their advisor who says they're taking away more than just bugs. Well, I think one thing they learn is that, you know, don't be afraid to try new things, go out there and uh, see how they work. Just a couple of high school students can make a difference. It doesn't end here. The students are collecting data and plan to share it with the community to help expand their efforts. In Piscataway, New Jersey, Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. And from their research, the students also suggest targeting the eggs now. Head over to our website for expert tips on the best way to remove the eggs from trees and your yard before they hatch in the spring.